You know, anger can be a good thing. Yeah. Anger can be a very good thing. There are certain anger that help me. And there are certain anger that make me regret. Anger can be a good thing. Even the Bible says you sometimes get angry. The Bible says you can get angry. But what? Don't sin. <laughs> Ephesians chapter 4, verse 26 to the verse 27. Be ye angry and sin not. Verse 26, yes. Be ye angry and sin not. Let not the sun go down upon your anger. <laughs> they get angry, but make sure you didn't sin. Get angry, but make sure you don't insult. Get angry, but make sure you don't break things. Make sure you don't destroy things. Somebody provoke you. Somebody, somebody hurt you. You can get angry. But don't let that anger lead you to sin. Everybody, everybody can get angry. Everybody, everybody, including me. <laughs> Even Jesus got angry so many times. In his case, he even broke things, scattered things in the temple. <laughs> so there is a good aspect of anger. But the type that is very dangerous is the one that when it comes upon you, you become like a lion. You want to tear things apart. You want to prove to people who you are. Hey, you know who you are dealing with? Do you know me? I, 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 will, I, I will show you something. <laughs> you know who I am? You know who I be? <laughs> I will show you something. <laughs> that is a bad anger. Yeah. That is the bad anger. The anger that when it come upon you, you, you want to do something bloody. You want to do something bad. You want to do something wicked. That is a bad anger. Bad anger. You want to break a car. You want to break a TV. A guy was telling me about a girlfriend. Anytime they get angry, she will break the TV or break something in the house. Take the phone, hit it to break it to prove that I am mad. Yes, now I am mad. <laughs> <laughs> She will take your mobile phone, crack it, and say, yes, I am now mad. Mad, mad, yes, mad, mad. <laughs> you, know who, you know who I be? You know who you are dealing with? <laughs> you think me idiot? You think I am a fool? <laughs> I will show you. I've been gentle. I've been quiet for all these years. All this time around, I've been quiet. And you know it. <laughs> <laughs> And especially a certain country, their women. <laughs> come, come, come. Let me use it for illustration. Don't pretend you don't know what I'm about to tell you. <laughs> you see how certain country, when the women are angry, come here, come here. You, say, <laughs> you know who I am? You know me? You know me? You know me? You want to beat me? You are angry? <coughs> you are angry? And talk now, talk, talk. <laughs> then they are pushing you. What can you do? What can you do? Have me quiet. <laughs> they want to scatter everything. Don't hold me. Hey, no, no, hey, don't hold me. Allow me. Hey. <coughs> it's okay. They want to break things very violent. That type of anger is dangerous. Yeah. That type of anger. No, somebody say, oh, keep quiet. Say, no, no, don't tell me that. Don't tell me to be quiet. Don't, 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 don't stop me. Ah, something is doing me. Don't touch me. No. Oh, that is very dangerous. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and in marriage, 
You go to bed, you, you do like this. Your partner also do like this. Social distance. Don't touch me. <laughs> At the night, you put your hand like this. You hear? <laughs> At the night, you put that. The sun will even get up and go and sleep in the sofa. Don't talk to me. Mr. Man! Mr. Man! Mr. Man! You know, I've I, 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 I been called to such a certain matter. And when I enter the house, you can feel the presence of anger all over the house. And the beautiful woman who always comes to church singing, very nice, speaking in tones, when you look at her face, it's like decorated monkey. <laughs> Hi, prophet. <laughs> See, hey! <laughs> what has happened to your face like this? Hi, prophet. Say, how are you? They say, come and sit down, let's talk. <laughs> hey! Anger. Ready to devour. Ready to devour. Yeah. And when she started talking, things, things that are even family secret, certain things that nobody should know, you say it because you are angry. Certain things that happen between the two of you, that are personal thing, you say it. <laughs> it's not about cheating, but you say he cheated on you, 1941. <laughs> but we are talking about what happened currently. We are talking about what happened now. So what, what, what is 1941 doing today? You are just angry. So you want to say all the bad things about the person. Anger. You want to devour. Yeah. You want to devour, ready to devour. Put on the face. Hey. Some people are very anointed to show that they are angry. You can see <laughs> from their face. Pull their mouth. <laughs> you know, sometimes when I am called to attend to certain serious issue, I feel like laughing, but I can't laugh. I have to be very serious. <laughs> so, I, you know, I want to laugh, but you know, the husband will come and, and also, and the wife also come. Then it's like two two enemies ready to devour. <laughs> yeah, ready to devour. Then then you look at this one face. Look at this one face. <laughs> hey! <laughs> hey! Hey! But do you know the good things about it? Following Sunday, they dress up ready to come to church, honey, baby. Like everything is fine. Hey! <laughs> Then after church, me too, I'll tell them something. I'll say, hey, you people, I'm afraid of you. You remember two days ago? <laughs> you remember two days ago when I came to your house? <laughs> anger! That type of anger is dangerous. Hear me? The devil can take over you when you find yourself at that place. Because hear me, the moment you get angry to that degree, your brain stops working. The only thing that is working is your feeling and your emotion. Listen to me. Anytime you get to that place of anger, your brain stops working. And the only thing that is working is how you feel. You become so sensitive to that feeling of pain, of how somebody treated you or dealt with you. So hear me, you can easily kill. Yeah. 
There are certain people I told them that you people, you should have a place where you keep weapons like knife and some of those things because the way the two of you can get angry, hit each other, is dangerous. Yeah. It's very dangerous. The way the two of you can get angry. The husband will press the wife's neck and, and, and you know, like, like, like wrestling. Like Olympic. Ah, ah, what is this? Like boxing. Real. Not movie. Real. Press the neck. I'll kill you today. And she also be using her long nails, scratching the back. Scratching. Hey. Dangerous. At that point, what is knife? What is gun? What is weapon? You can easily kill. That type of anger is dangerous. Anything, any spirit at all can take over you. Anything, any spirit at all. Let's continue. The verse 27. I love that place. Neither give place to the devil. That type of anger give place to the devil. Because at that point, your brain stopped thinking. The only thing that is working is what? Your emotion and your feeling. You know I mean? If your brain is working eh, at that moment, you will not frown the way you frown because you know that this is just a small issue, we can solve it, and our marriage still continue. Yeah. So no matter how you get angry, when the when she cook or he you eat it. Oh me, if I'm angry, that's why I will eat. I will wake you up even in the middle and say, Can you give me something to eat? He says, I'm angry, so she cook, I will not eat it. What is wrong with you? Huh? She cook and you, you eat it, break the bones, even ask for more. Can you do you have any drink in the fridge? <laughs> Can you give me toothpick? <laughs> ah! And that night you the two of you sleep, then you sleep here, she also sleep here. That night supernatural encounter with Jesus. We will close late. <laughs> I don't understand why single people are laughing like this. Who do you people know? <laughs> that type of anger. Give place to the devil. Give place to the devil. Oh, you know some of the things we see on social media, they are real. A woman get angry and cut the man's manhood. Yeah. Woman get angry and pour acid on the man. And the whole face corrode. Those things are real. Woman get angry and probe the, 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 the car, hit the windscreen and everything. These things are real. Woman get angry and poison. A husband get angry and shoot the wife. We, 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 we all these things, we have heard it. It is happening. Anger. People get angry and resign from their job just to be jobless after so many years searching for a job. People get angry and make certain decisions that after that they regret. Angry. Hmm. Anger. That type of anger gives place to the devil. People are get angry and pack their things out of their matrimonial home. Yeah. People get angry and break things and destroy things and fight. The lady was telling me, say, Prophet! Somebody called me. That, uh, uh, they saw my boyfriend and another lady. They, 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 they came to the house. I am going. I dress in my shirt. I am going. I am going to break that door. I am going to prove to him who I be. <laughs> A man who is not married to you. <laughs> prove it to you that you know I love other women apart from you or in addition to you. What is there to fight? Hello, what is there to find? Welcome to Mega Prophetic Ministry. We are prophetic. We are apostolic. We are a mega family.